Hello, this is Stacy from Lee Page's technical support team. Here's today's tech tip. While we provide built-in analytics for all of your pages, sites, and conversion tools, you can also use third-party analytics or tracking code. Tools like Facebook Pixel provide powerful metrics so you can get even more data on your pages and forms performance. The Facebook Pixel is code that you can place on your website, pages, or conversion tools. It collects data that helps you track conversions from Facebook ads, optimize ads, build targeted audiences for future ads, and remarket to people who have already taken some kind of action on your website or pages. In this video, we'll be showing you how to locate your Pixel in Facebook, then where to place it inside of lead pages. For future support on Pixels, reach out to Facebook directly as we are unable to support this. The first thing I want to do is go to my Ads Manager to create that Pixel. So I'm going to go into here and I'm going to go to Create, and I'm going to go to Add. This is going to take me to my Ads Manager and then I can create a new pixel. Once I'm inside of here, I can go ahead and go to this top menu in the left corner. And then I'm going to start over. And I'm going to go back to the Ads Manager menu. I'm going to go down to this Events Manager and you want to select Pixels. From there, it's going to take you to create a pixel. If you already have a pixel created, this is also where you'll find it. So I'm going to select create a pixel. As I'm creating a pixel, I can say a name. I can also include my lead pages URL or my lead pages website here. I'm going to skip that part and go to create. From there, it will give me all the options for my pixel and I'm just going to set the basics. So I'm going to manually install the pixel code myself, and I'm going to grab this code. So I'm going to grab this, and then I'm going to go into the builder again, and to place this, you're going to select Tracking on the left-hand menu. Then you're going to select Analytics. And in the Head Section Tracking Code, you can place that code. So I'm placing it right inside of here. So here's my Facebook pixel code. And then it's important to select Save so it remembers these changes. You can put multiple codes inside of this tracking section. So you can just hit Enter, and then you can place more code. Now that I've done this, I want to make sure that I am updating my page. This is an unpublished page, so I'm going to go ahead and publish. To make sure your Pixel is working, there's something called the Facebook Pixel Helper. And you can find that by just searching Facebook Pixel Helper, and there's an extension in Chrome that I've already downloaded onto my page. So I'm going to copy that link and go to the page so I can make sure that my Facebook Pixel is working. So up in my top corner, I'm going to select that Facebook Pixel Helper, and I'll see that I have found a pixel on my page, so it's working as expected. If you have any questions on this or anything else, please select the question mark inside of your account and builder to reach out to our support team and also search our knowledge base. Again, if you have questions on Facebook Pixel directly, you can reach out to Facebook's team. Again, here's that question mark. See you next time.